Welcome to the class. Today our topic is install Docker on Oracle Linux 8. Log in my Linux box. Also you can create the VM your local, doesn't matter. Switch to the root user. I use the Microsoft VS Code as a SS client, as the remote login tool. You can use the same tool or you can use PuTTY to straightforward login your VM or Linux physical box. First step, stop your firewall. Disable the firewall. If you only stop your firewall, after you reboot your system, firewall will be running again. DNF is a new generation package manager tool in the Oracle Linux. DNF install zip and unzip tool. Minor why we don't want to DNF show alert message like yes or no when we install the tool. DNF Configure Manager used to add the Docker repository to your local system. DNF install Docker CE, not best. That command used to install Docker and automatically choose which version match to your system. Install successfully. Systemctl enable docker.service command used to enable docker service when your system start up. Start the docker service now. Check the service information is running. Docker info command is showing Docker basic config and the installation information. Storage driver overlay tool, volume, local volume, bridge as a default network, log information, operation system information. That is showing you my physical machine information, core of the CPU. Docker version 19.03.13. As now, we use the root user run the all the Docker command. In future, if you want to Run the Docker as a normal user. We have to do, we have to run below command. Group add Docker already exists. Lian is my username. Docker is group name. That command will add Lian user to the Docker group. If you don't have user yet, user add command will be help you add user. Add alias to your B shell profile. Open other terminal and test Docker command. Oh, there's a permission deny message. Because after we changed the B shell profile, we didn't re log in. For that scenario, we can use the source dot B shell profile to refresh the B-shell environment. After that, no issue anymore. 
Docker run hello world. This command is used to run a simple Docker image. The message shows us Docker install config and running without any issue. First, we'll see pooling. Previous chapter were introduced what is Docker run logic behind the scene. Let me refresh your memory. Pooling. If the Docker run cannot find hello world image in your local, Docker engine will be talked to the Docker hub to download hello world Docker image. Next, Docker create a container based on hello world image. We are going to install Docker Compose. Docker Compose is able to run and manage multiple Docker containers. We use the latest uh, stable Docker Compose version, 1.27.4. We use the command to download and copy Docker Compose to slash user slash local slash bin slash docker minor compose folder. Download and copy. Change the permission for the folder. We switch to lien user. Run docker compose command. No issue. Check version. There's the docker compose version. Same as our download URL, 1.27.4. Thank you for watching. See you next lesson.